The object began to attract more attention. Increasing number of people were reported missing in the region, but upon being found, they were no longer human. Headlines of zombies and the walking dead sprawled across the media. Our operatives intervened immediately. Large volumes of the Class C amnestic supply have been expended. Evidently, SCP-0492 retain neither memories nor mental abilities and possess only rudimentary motor skills and reactions. While being generally passive, moving infrequently and erratically, SCP-0492 can become extremely aggressive when prompted or commanded by SCP-049. Several dozen units of SCP-0492 were located. SCP-049 remained undetected. We knew that something or someone caused the humans to transform into SCP-0492, but the object itself was never seen. The situation was resolved by a chance. Our officers have intercepted a local police transmission that mentioned the walking dead. 401? Repeat, please. The object surrendered without any resistance when Task Force Omega-7 neutralized all SCP-0492s. Translation, sir. I can speak it well enough. Good. My name is Dr. Raymond Ham, and I am ah, a doctor such as myself. Wonders abound. And here, I worried I had been abducted by common street thugs. This place, then, this is your laboratory. I had wondered, as clean as it is, and with such little trace of the pestilence here. The pestilence? What do you mean? The pestilence, yes. It abounds outside these walls, you know. So many have succumbed, and many more will continue to, until such time as a perfect cure can be developed. It is my duty in life to rid the world of it, you see. You think you cured those people? Indeed. My cure is most effective. But the things we recovered were not human. Yes, well... It is not a perfect cure, but that will come with time. There is work to do. I will require a laboratory of my own, one where I can continue my research unimpeded. And assistance, of course, though I can provide those on my own in time. <laughs> The zone personnel went to meet SCP-049's requests. 
He was given several D-class staff units to choose from. SCP-049 instantly killed the one that showed a slight symptom of a wellness. Dr. Ham proceeded to study the object. However, after a considerable amount of time, the results were insignificant. The Foundation had not retrieved any information on how the object turned people into creatures. The members of the O5 Council were waiting for Dr. Ham to provide new comprehensive data on the object as soon as possible. The doctor worked around the clock and had no time for sleep. The task was of utmost importance, and Ham felt that the solution was very close. However, he had no idea what it would cost him. Working with sensitive objects is always a high risk of accidents. When the cell unit of the SCP-166 with its pungent smell was being sanitized, critical safety precautions were ignored. The employees simply did not expect for anyone else to appear at the containment block so late at night. Of course, this does not justify the violation. The next day, they were transported to SCP-682 containment cell. I don't know anything about the further fate. <coughs> As for Dr. Ham, the fatigue and damage from SCP-166 has taken a stall. He entered SCP-049 cell with apparent signs of sickness, albeit artificially induced. But for SCP-049, this was quite enough. I need you to explain yourself. My actions do not need to be explained. You killed Raymond Ham, and then butchered him until not he- Not dead. No, not, not dead. He is, he is cured. Cured? Cured of what? The... Your cure cost Ray his life. I, I would not expect you to understand. You and your, your ilk have proven time and time again not to be men of science, but men of, of emotion. You cannot appreciate the horrors I have seen. Those many millions who have succumbed to the pestilence and been changed. What pestilence? He was a healthy man. He was a good doctor. You are not worth this argument, sir. You are short-sighted and foolish. Dr. Ham was sick, and I... I cured him. I am the only one who can do this. My work must continue. There is still so much to learn, so much I've to had do. enough of this. And Consider your allowances be saved. Even you. Welcome to containment to 049. Might be saved. We're done here. I can save them all. I can cast down this plague once and for all. I can do this. Only me. I am. I saved him. I saved him. Dr. Ham. I... I cured him. He was sick. I know he was sick. I know he was. And I... You are all sick. 
But I, I can save you. I can save all of you because I, I am the cure.